Prepare for the TOEFL listening section with this sample conversation. Listen to the conversation, answer the questions about it, check your score at the end of the video, review the conversation to understand the correct answers. Subscribe for more TOEFL listening practice with conversations. Hey, Maya, how's your research project coming along? Hey, Alex, it's going okay. I'm struggling to find enough relevant sources for my psychology project. Maybe try searching through the library databases. They have tons of academic journals and articles. Good call. I haven't really explored those yet. Maybe I can refine my keywords and see what comes up. Sure. And don't forget to check out the reference sections of the articles you already have. They might lead you to even more resources. Awesome. Thanks for the tip, Alex. The problem is, my topic feels a little broad right now. I chose the influence of social media on mental health, but it feels overwhelming. I understand. Maybe you can narrow it down a bit. For example, are you interested in the impact of social media on anxiety or depression, or maybe the effect of cyberbullying on teenagers? Focusing on the impact on teenagers could be interesting, especially with the rise of social media use at younger ages. Definitely. There's probably a lot of research on that specific topic. Once you have a narrower focus, you can use more specific keywords in your database searches. That makes sense. Maybe something like impact of social media use on teenage self-esteem or anxiety in teenagers and social media comparison. Those are great starting points. Once you have a good selection of articles, be sure to evaluate the credibility of the sources. Look for scholarly journals published by reputable institutions. That's important. I wouldn't want to base my research on unreliable information. Are there any specific databases you recommend for psychology research? Sure. The library website should have a list of academic databases specifically for social sciences. There's also a research librarian who can offer one-on-one -on -one consultations to help you navigate the databases and find relevant sources. A research librarian? I didn't know that was a thing. That sounds super helpful. It is. They're experts in research and can save you a lot of time and frustration. Maybe schedule a consultation after you've narrowed down your topic and started searching for sources. One, what is the woman struggling with in her research project? Two, why does the man suggest the woman should check the reference sections of the articles she already has? Three, why does the man emphasize the importance of evaluating the credibility of sources? Four, why does the man suggest the woman should schedule a consultation with a research librarian? Listen to part of the conversation again. I understand. Maybe you can narrow it down a bit. For example, are you interested in the impact of social media on anxiety or depression, or maybe the effect of cyberbullying on teenagers? What does the man mean by saying? Maybe you can narrow it down a bit.
how did it go? Were you able to answer the questions correctly? Share your score in the comments below. Like, comment, and subscribe for more TOEFL listening practice with lectures and conversations.